Hello everyone, my name is Dylan. Welcome back to that wrestling show. Today I am doing a unboxing slash review on AEW Unmatched Series 5, Brian Danielson. Um, this is actually my first, I guess, elite Brian Danielson. Um the Daniel the WWE Daniel Bryan figures that I've had in the past were all basics. I've only had two Daniel Bryan figures before. Both of them were basics. This is my first, I guess, elite or whatever Daniel Bryan figure. So it's very nice to have an updated version. Um Definitely an upgrade from my last one. This looks like a very nice figure. It does look a little bit tall, and I've heard people say this figure is too tall. Um, but we'll just have to find, wait and see. Um, let's get into the box first. We got the figure right here. Uh, Brian Danielson over here, one of the greatest, one of the greats. It says Unmatched Collection, Series 5, number 37. Brian Danielson, the AEW logo, AEW logo, AEW logo. Then on the back, you have all his information with the picture of him. This is the first figure in this set that I do have. Um, I don't know if I'll try and collect the other ones because I don't I don't care for these kinds of figures. Um, the Sammy Guevara, I want to get a different kind of Sammy Guevara. I want to get like a normal attire. I'm pretty sure this is like the prison gear attire from like the Blood and Guts thing. Uh, that's And then that's just, that's like a street uh, Kenny Omega. I don't really care for Red Velvet. I, the only one I might get is that Sean Spears. But... Definitely, this is probably going to be the best figure out of the set. Now that we reviewed the box, let's get into the figure. So the figure's out of the box, and wow, this is a really good figure. Like, it's actually really good. Um, Has perfect articulation. I love the design on the figure. The head is amazing. Um, But let's go into the accessories first before I get too sucked into getting into the figure. But first, we got two interchangeable fist hands, and then we got a... This I really like. So they have the ponytail up version of the, uh, Brian Danielson. And then when he's like in the match, he's like a screaming and his ponytail's down and everything. I think that's really cool. I got a little paint thing on my, uh, on this one's nose. But that I think that's so cool how they did that. Very smart. Then we got the figure. Let's go into the kick pads. These kick pads look beautiful. I love the design with the red and silver. That looks really good. Good articulation too. Same with this one. It's also good articulation. Then we go to the knee pads. I've never seen AEW use these kinds of knee pads. Um, but they need to do it more because these knee pads are phenomenal. I love these knee pads. For I'm like really into the knee pads. Um, good leg articulation too. Solid on the knees. The upper leg over here, pretty stiff. But like all AEW figures are pretty much. Uh, then we got the same red and silver and white design on the trunks. We got the chest piece over here. Good articulation over there. Then we got good articulation in the shoulders and the arms. Um, just two standard Mike Holden hands over here. Then we got the head scan. Uh, a really good head scan. We got the beard, ponytail up. I want to, because I, it originally had this head scan, but I wanted to switch it out with this one. And the head was really, really hard to get off and to put the um, this one on. But, you know, that's like, that's only if you take the heads off. So it's not really that big of a problem. It's only is if you're like switching heads. And even then you can just heat them up a little bit. But yeah, a really good figure. Also, I got my old Brian Danielson to check the height. By the way, this is the Brian Danielson I was using before. As yeah, as you can tell, huge upgrade. There is no height difference. I thought this one was bigger, but I guess I was wrong. Um, normal size Brian Danielson, which is perfect. Um, he does look a little bit more muscular, though, in the chest area. But, you know, who cares? But definitely huge upgrade from my previous Daniel Bryan and Bryan Danis and whatever. Amazing figure. Uh, way better than I expected it to be. Uh, I thought it was going to be, like, too big or too stiff or whatever. Perfect articulation. Perfect size. Perfect everything. Great figure. Great wrestler. And thank you guys so much for watching. This has been my review on AEW Unmatched Series 9, I think, Brian Danielson. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.